I don't care if I F up. I'm going to do this video in one take, and that is it. I am pretty excited about this song, though. One of my ads on my fantasy playlist the week of April 28, 1985. See it? Mathematics by Melissa Manchester. Forgot all about that. That is a lost. It is totally lost, 45. Melissa Manchester. Melissa Manchester from the Bronx. Her dad played in the New York Metropolitan Orchestra. She attended when she took a songwriting course. Let me back up. Gotta slow down and calm down a little bit. Too excited. I'm overheating like a car. Gotta pour, gotta pour some uh, antifreeze into my system. 1970, Melissa Manchester, New York University, took a songwriting course taught by Paul Simon. She got into the Manhattan club scene soon afterward. She was discovered by Barry Manilow. Barry Manilow introduced her to Bed Midler. Bed Midler included Melissa Manchester into her backup group called the Harlettes. This was in 1971. 1973, Melissa Manchester released her first album, but it wasn't until 1975 she had her first massive hit. Midnight Blue. Just You and I, I believe, was another hit record by her, Lost 45, Don't Cry Out Loud, which came out in 1978, 79. And I just found this out from researching Melissa Manchester. She co-wrote the song, Whenever I Call You Friend. Massive hit for Kenny Loggins and Stevie Knox, Steve, Stevie Nicks, rather. <laughs> Kenny Loggins and Stevie Nicks back in 1978. Melissa Manchester was known for ballads. That was her comfort zone, but in 1982, she recorded, probably under the influence of producer Areth Mardine, she recorded You Should Hear How She Talks About You, which was originally done by Charlie Dore, but Melissa Manchester recorded a dance version of it. Complete change of style for, for Melissa Manchester, but musical styles were changing in the 80s. She had to go along with it, but she did admit later on that she had to be Pulled, kicking and kicking and screaming to record. You should hear how she talks about you. Not a favorite record for Melissa Manchester. And then she recorded Mathematics a few years later, another dance record, but didn't do nearly as well as uh, You Should Hear How She Talks About You. Mathematics went up to number 74. That's it on Billboard's Hot 100. But I like the way she raps on this record. She's not she's not a half bad rap, rapper, if you ask me. Here it is, Melissa Manchester with Mathematics from my fancy playlist, April 28th, 1985.